housing project and how to turn ball and sports and turn your life around. He talked about character, integrity. OJ, I got a hand, Coach. He did a great job, right? <laughs> Kids were all psyched. And OJ shook their hands and said, you can do it, kid, blah, 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 right on. Then, my partner, I went into his trailer afterwards while the kids were touring and watching the movie. They said, hey, OJ was like a frustrated cop. He wanted to hear cop war stories. I mean, he wanted to listen to us tell him, you know, about arrests and all this deep stuff. Right? right? He was like a frustrated cop. So then he gives us his business card to the Bundy condominium. What happened at the Bundy condo? Right? Yeah. Yeah. So it's right there. If you're over town, come on, have a beer. Yeah. 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 The condo, blah, blah, blah. <laughs> a month later, it's the murder. Right. Oh, but before the murder took place, right after the uh, OJ, after we went to Long Beach, uh, I go to the captain of my police station. You know what? We got to write an OJ a thank you letter from Los Angeles Police Department. He goes, okay, <laughs> well, write the letter, and you'll have the chief sign it, and I'll sign it. You know, because you had to write, run it up to the chief, and they came back. So we wrote this letter, thank you, all this stuff, right? About a month later, the murders happened, right? So the captain comes up to me and says, you know, I know somebody you could get to be a mentor to speak to this kids. I go, oh, go, why don't we get Charles Manson? <laughs> <laughs> and then I can write, I can put my name all over that. Thank you, Charlie. 